Whoops. Salad means recorded, right? It's recording. Yeah. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, grand finals. My boy, D63 Kunga Oak, and the guy that has cleared up the bracket today in losers, Lemony Bard. And we're starting out with a Falco Ditto. This is going to be very interesting to see. Um, I know Kunga definitely plays Falco really well. Um, Lemony also, not his main, but he also, they both play Falco, but neither of them main this character. So, both going small battlefield, keeping up close quarters, I like it. And uh, right now, it's uh, Kungur Oak who actually has the momentum right now. But if it's one thing that I've been seeing from Lemmy all day, is that he knows when to go in and out of the disadvantage. So, uh, oh, except for when it comes to taking that back here, though. Oh, wow, that would have been... Hey, yo. <laughs> the side B into the down smash would have been insane and really early stock off of Lemmy. But Lemmy's still in this. He's getting the percentage up on Kunger, so uh, just one good forward and a smash should take this first stock. Nice, nice side side B. All right, I think he like baited him. I think Lemony baited uh, Kunger with the uh, beautiful down smash, taking that stock up two stocks. That was insane. That was an insane play from DC3 Kunger. Oh my goodness. All right, so game one definitely looking in favor of Kungro, but you know, like I always say, until that screen says game, it ain't over. All right, yeah, so that was a nice stall. All right, Lemony actually trying really hard to take this first stock, but he's still like struggling to take this kill. Kungro Kungro literally holding on to the stock as if it was his last turning stock. But that uh, what was that uh, back throw? That was a very I love how the uh, the laser in that was the one that took the stock. That was actually kind of crazy. Oh wow! Now you're seeing some really beautiful bread and butters from uh, Falco. All right, Kungur's still having a decent lead in this first game, so Lemony's really just gonna have. If he wants this game, he's really got to play extremely careful. Cause DC3 Kungur, you know, he came back to still take this win, bro. He said, "Ain't nothing changed since I left." <laughs> nice backer coming out from Kungur, but not taking it just yet. Oh wow, nice neutral get up into the back throw from Lemony, but. Um, Kungro is able to get back, taking it with an up smash, and taking game number one. My favorite play from that was definitely the uh, the down the, the down smash. That was insane. <laughs> All right, game one going into Kungro. I wonder if we're gonna see a character switch from Lemony. I'm also wondering if we're gonna see a uh, character switch from Kungro. But I I doubt it. I still can't believe they really ban ring a ding just for just for the like that was the cutest song in this whole game like are you kidding me Period. let's go all right he went lemony went straight to his main so now we're getting the mennonite in falco couldn't grow up feeling so comfortable that he doesn't have to pull out his main right now i kind of i respect it actually all right so Kungurok actually getting the first interaction and having a good oh wow now they're both sitting at a uh, a good 25 percent but Kungurok extending this lead by just a little bit I'm out of make a name for myself let's go oh Koitsu nice to see you in the chat bro he said let's go lady what yo bro bro hyping up the chat bro we miss you we can't wait till you come back bro but take your time Oh wow, nice forward smash coming out from Kungurok, so he's still in the uh, having the momentum and taking the first stock in this uh, second game. Lemony, looks like he's more so just trying to, uh, playing this a little too impatient now, and I think Kungurok's trying to expose that just a little bit, but I have seen Lemony, you know, reverse his game plan, game plan mid-game, so. Actually, almost taking that first stock, what, what, I think that's Mennonite's down B.
Oh wow, Lemony taking the first stock with a, I think that was his forward smash or down smash, I couldn't really tell. But, you know, Kunger still having the, uh, having the advantage and having the momentum right now. Lemonade, Lemony's trying to come back, but Austin coming back as well with the aggression. Both of these, both of these players, from what I've seen today, uh, they know how to control their aggressive state, bro. They know how to control their offensive state. Um... Kungro doing it just a little bit better, taking that second stock off Lemony in this game number two. So Lemony's really got to like find a game plan to this spot. I wonder if he's gonna try to go for a different stage or ban or no. Yeah, I wonder if he's gonna try to go to a different stage if he loses this game. But oh wow, tried to uh, bait Kungro, but you know Kungro always being ready for that, so not quite taking it. Tries to poke his shield with the uh, forward air, but Lemony was ready for that as well. So now we're just seeing more like going back for tit for tat type things. Forward smash, that was a nice forward smash to kind of like a get off me tool. Did that take it? Oh my goodness. That He literally just sniped him with that down smash. What? He didn't even go off. He didn't even, I mean, that, that happened so fast. Like, I don't even think he went off stage for that. He literally just threw it out and it worked. I'm pretty sure that threw Lemony off, off guard too because I think he air dodged there's like stuffing out his recovery wow so I just heard DC3 get locked the fuck in that's what I'm saying bro like Kungro is not taking any prisoners today <laughs> wow alright so I just heard Kungro is gonna go Ness and I wonder if they're still gonna go small I wonder what stage Lemony's gonna go to I wonder if he's gonna go uh, small battlefield or try to change it out for this potential last game for him. Someone tell him lock in for me. <laughs> <laughs> wow, and he's also thinking about his character pick. See, he had me, let me have me doing this earlier. I'm like, who the heck do I go? Do I go Peach? Do I go ZSS? Do I which stage do I go? So like, this is how you know that like everyone today was not playing around. They were taking their stage band serious. They were taking their character counterfeit serious. No one was letting up today. And that's what I'm starting to see. And that's what I love. Despite only having, what, nine participants today? How many participants? Ten. Despite having ten only ten participants in this in today's tourney, we still have everyone playing like everything is on the line. Oh, wow. So it looks like Hollow Bastion is going to be for game number three. I'm curious to see who Lemony is going to go against this nest. I know he has Meta Knight and he has Falco, and I haven't seen he, I haven't seen him pull out anyone else. So I'm curious to see who he's gonna go. Cause Ness, like he knows what this nest can bring. He does not want to sleep up on this nest. So I don't blame him for taking a sweet time trying to decide who he wants to go. Oh, oh. Wait, Lemony? No. Oh, yeah, I was talking about Lemony. Taking his sweet, I actually like. See, I think more players like when they are down, like a really down in deficit. I think they should take their time with their characters and stage fix. Cause this is this is a uh, Lemonade's first grand final, so he definitely doesn't want to just you know go out in a three zero. But he also knows exactly you know the kind of heat he has to bring if he wants to uh, take this set. All right, so now I'm seeing Lemony actually playing a little bit more patient against this mess. But it seems like everything that Lemony wants to throw... Bro, okay, that... <laughs> that OB was crazy from Ness. Um, Lemony trying to challenge, but Kungro being so polished with his character, uh, just hit that up B and took that stock really early. And now, like, he just has this... He just has Lemony in the ropes right now, still has a percent lead. Um, crazy momentum state that was just that just left me <laughs> speechless bro <laughs> that was like whoa another punish for lemony actually trying to get aggressive this is not looking too good for lemony right now because okunga is just like all over him while also like going in straight to punish everything that this man wants to do which is very ironic because like this man was telling me earlier how like he was playing a little bit nervous and he was saying in the chat he was nervous but right now he doesn't seem to be playing like he's nervous he's saying he's oh wait but maybe he is because that un that accidental sd makes him take his first stop but if i was him i wouldn't worry about it i'm up two games 
I have zero percent on me. My opponent's on this last stock. I just got two really hype page, two hype plays. The momentum is most definitely still in the King Grove's favor right now, and Lemony just really has to figure out how to handle this Ness. Do I go in? Do I stay out? Do I take my time? Do I try to rush in? Like, what can I do against this nest right now? These are the questions I'll be asking myself if I was Lemony. Did that back air take? The back air actually taking it. Uh, that was a JV3, actually. So, cleaning it out with 3 0, JV3 coming from DC3 Cougar Oak with those really hype plays. What a tournament. Thank you for everyone who comes out, and we will see you guys next time. That was.